Hello everybody, this is Danny Rolos from China Gadgets Reviews. In this video we'll take a quick look at the Blue Bull Maya smartphone. This one, an amazing budget smartphone with 2GB of RAM, 16GB of internal storage, quad-core processor from MediaTek, 5.5 high definition display, 3000 mAh battery, FM radio, Wi-Fi, GPS, Android Marshmallow 6.0 out of the box and much more. Okay, so let's take a look in settings first. Here <coughs> we have Wi-Fi tab, Bluetooth, SIM cards, so SIM cards, this is dual SIM smartphone as you can see no SIM inserted yet more tab here display Miravision technology here cast LED easy light here ok let's go back sound and notification sound enhancement ok application storage and USB as I told you 16 gigabyte of internal storage battery tab here okay memory so we have 2 gigabyte of total memory location security tab accounts language and input here we have all the languages in the world okay sorry like this let's go back backup and reset tab date and time scheduled power on and off accessibility here printing and about the phone you can see this is the Maya model Android version Android Marshmallow 6.0 stock firmware ok let's go back this is the build number ok wireless update this is current firmware check for updates up to date ok let's go back we have blue Bull beauty snap application nice application from blue Bull. in antutu benchmark 6.2.0 we have over 22,000 points nice score for a budget smartphone in Antutu Vito Tester almost 500 points 467 11 items fully supported 7 items video and other audio files partially supported and 12 items not supported yet by this firmware version ok let's go back Let's take a look here for more info. As I told you, quad core processor from MediaTek. The graphic processor unit is a Mali 400 MP. This is the device, model, board, and so on. The screen density is good. The screen resolution is high definition, as you can see. 2 GB of RAM. This is done with Marshmallow 6.0. This is the battery and sensors on board light, proximity, and accelerometer. Okay, let's go back. So, let's check if this firmware has root access. Verify root. This firmware version does not have root access. 
Play Store is working just fine. As you can see, no problem here. The Wi-Fi speed is very good, over 20 megabytes per second in upload and download also. The router is in the other room, not here, not in this room. The speed is just fantastic. 25 in download and 21 megabytes per second in upload. Very nice. Okay. Back camera is 30 megapixel. Very nice camera. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching, see you soon, bye.